we are been on a journey from Telkom, and I think as previously relayed in you know various engagements with the audiences, we have reiterated the fact that with COVID, you know, we've seen what we call a digital acceleration. There's a yearning for customers to really want to embrace, you know, digital solutions in a digital environment. So with this steps, you know, there are sequence of things that we've done. You'll see, for argument that we recently launched our T-Cash app uh, with significant enhancements. We've looked at more different types of propositions in line with what customers are doing. And so what we're saying is, you know, and I come here from a marketing standpoint. In marketing, you do a lot of things. You've got, you know, TV ads, you've got word of mouth, you've got search engine optimization, you've got websites, you've got all these old platforms that allow you to engage with the customer. But you know, from a marketing standpoint, you can only save so much in a 30 second ad. We know for a fact, when you're looking at more digital touch points, things like, um, you know, social media platforms, you can only tell a customer in five, 10 seconds. And that only whets their appetite. So what we are doing now is giving customers opportunity to go to our website, to look for more solutions, to understand what we have, what new propositions we are building for them, where they can give us feedback, where we can actually engage. These websites allow us to have what we call deep, meaningful uh, engagements. Yes, as I said, there's outbound and inbound marketing. Outbound marketing is you know, what we see from a TV ad and all those kind of things. This inbound gives us opportunity to really engage. It gives us customers the opportunity to you know, tell us where they need improvement. It also gives us the opportunity to ask questions. So with things like the website, which I'll encourage everybody to go and look at is, it's an opportunity for us to engage and have meaningful conversations at a one-to-one -one level. Yes, we do have that to some extent when you DM me on my Twitter touch point, but just to be fair to you, are you talking to the CEO? Are you talking to the CX director? When you come to our website, it allows us time to orchestrate, to really look deeply, pull out those conversations and have real content conversations about you. What do you want? What are you not getting? It gives us opportunity to explore and engage better. This digital customer is what I call highly aware, agile, and they're always searching for new opportunities. So by you giving us you know, opportunity to engage with you, it also allows us to understand what you do not want. You know, too many from a times from a marketing standpoint. We focus on what customers want. We also don't know to some extent what they don't want. So these interactions allow us to really co-create. Um, I know it's been used loosely, but we really want to co-create. I mean, if you look at some of the propositions we've launched fairly recently, things like Changa Bundle, our new, uh, what we call small home, home office uh, propositions, these products are largely based out of co-creation. We want to co-create. We want to bring to the customer to the center of the conversation to be the pinnacle of all our innovation. Because without the customer, we no longer exist. We're no longer of value. Telcos today, more often than not, are becoming what we call pipes. We're becoming like utility companies. That's not what we don't want. Our job is to create value for this customer. And that's what Telcom endeavors to do. Engage with customers to create value now and in the future. What a lot of people don't know is how rich our portfolio is. We've got a very broad uh, B2B architecture and product solutions for, for our customers. We've got wholesale products. We have, and wholesale is really about bringing in the backbone. A lot of people don't know that we have five uh, undersea cables that land in, and these are actually really uh, driven by, by Telcom Kenya. So if you want to understand what solutions you can come under there, I'd encourage you to tap into our website. We have public sector products, and some of them are very unique propositions. And some of them that some of you might not heard of are things like what we call uh, CIH. We have B2B solutions from our corporate uh, stable. And in there, you'll find things that you find, yes, with some of our competitors, but you'll also find some unique offerings. When you go into the website, you'll be able to find probably we have 80 to 90% of solutions that customers want or customers are looking for. And those that are not there, we can co-create for you.